What's up, Detroit? What's up, world? It's your man, Sandman, Mr. Sand44, man. I'm right here in the middle of Lock in Boston. I just wanted to let you know behind me, we got a nice little church over here. You've been seeing all the different houses and stuff that we have showed you. All the different abandoned buildings, abandoned apartments. I don't know, I, I lost count on how many houses and stuff we did. But right behind me, over my shoulder, is an abandoned building, another abandoned apartment building. But before I show you all that, I want you to see this abandoned apartment building over here. Now that red truck is a white guy, and he's a contractor, and he's just rolling around the neighborhood. But it's big, no problem, you know what I'm saying? See, we're allowing this shit to happen within our community because we don't care. And if you don't care, then what's your use? What's your purpose? So that's why it's up to cats like me because I'm tired of hearing that everybody sitting back saying, well, what are you going to do? Or what can you do to make it right. better? I'm doing it right now. I'm showing you. This is what we don't like. So get it together. And even if it don't make nobody move, I'm going to keep showing it over and over and loop and loop and loop and loop it. And as long as I keep looping it, you're going to get tired of seeing it. And you're going to get frustrated. And you're going to get on the internet. You're going to get on their congressman. You're going to talk to your senator. And you're going to tell them, how the hell did that man just walk in a abandoned house where my daughter and predators could be? My son could be dead. Hey, ask yourself, Detroit. Have we ever had anybody dead in the houses? Hey. Have we had any girls raped in any of these buildings? Hey. But, ask yourself, this man is out here doing something to show us that. This ain't no downtown shit, people. This straight up from the hood in Detroit. We in between Dexter and Linwood. And don't worry about all y'all other places, seven mile, six mile, five. I'm going from Jefferson to eight mile. Because I'm getting goddamn sick and tired of everybody sitting back saying that Detroit is past the eight mile. Detroit is Detroit, and if you don't know Detroit, you don't live here. Because Detroit rides nowhere but from Jefferson to 8 Mile. Ain't no 9, 14, 23. That ain't goddamn Detroit. That's your town, your hood. Because if you was in Detroit, you'd make sure our shit look like yours. Now, before I lose my composure any further, let me just show you the, the, the despicable surroundings in which your man deal with, where I hibernate and dwell with my people. Fellas, let them see this. Let them see it. Look at it. What's up with that? Only goddamn pretty thing down here is my goddamn car. Look at that. Just look at it. Somebody baby could be in there. I don't know what's in there. That's how much of that apartment is empty. A lot. The land. Look at the field. Where that motherfucker that owned that building at? Why his ass ain't being fine? Where is he at? Detroit, that's what we need to be asking. But matter of fact, you ain't got to worry about it because your man is on it. I'm asking a question. Where the hell is the person that owns that building? And why the fuck is it like that? And where's all those other people that got these buildings? Where's these building owners at? Why aren't they being held accountable for this? Where are they? Hold them accountable, y'all. I wouldn't let another goddamn politician in this goddamn city to run shit. When you got Lansing up here trying to run us, we can't think for ourselves, we can't do for ourselves. We gotta have help of Lansing. That just makes us seem like we just can't handle our business. Tell those motherfuckers that got those buildings like that in our goddamn hood to bring your ass down here and clean this shit up. Cause damn it, we ain't own these buildings. Nobody own them but your asses. Clean up your mess. Bring your ass out your goddamn suburban homes and come down here and take care of your shit. Cause it ain't ours. We just live around this shit. This is Sandman. And I'm sorry if I offend anybody, but fuck it, it's got to be known. I told you, this is Detroit Raw. And if you don't like it, get the fuck off my goddamn channel. Because this is for everybody that want to hear. I'm out.